my name is um, Chief uh, Tony Abubasa Abano. Uh, I'm a retired uh, public uh, officer. Uh, had over three decades of public sector exposure in uh, the public service of Delta State, but more of it was uh, in donor financed projects which climaxed as uh, in the capacity of uh, Delta State co Coordinator for the World Bank Financed Fadama Project. Uh, like I said, virtually all my over three decades in public service was, as a matter of fact, uh, international donor finance projects. We started with the ADP, uh, the, this, this of Delta, the, the ADP. Then from the ADP, we went to the International Fund for Agricultural Development, uh, referred to as uh, food security, and then from food security, I went to uh, Padama. <clears throat> I was also director of agri services at the state ministry. Okay. And then I was also uh, the head of uh, agri uh, entrepreneurship program in the newly job creation, created the job creation office. Uh, now I am self employed and uh, I still do those jobs with the National Office of uh, the Fadama Project and the uh, Nigerian World Bank Country Office mm. and uh, some consultancy jobs on agriculture. My background is essentially in agricultural management, for the bachelor's in agriculture, the master's in business administration. A diploma in economics and uh, another diploma in computer science. Uh, well, I'm married, but because I go with uh, four men as uh, children. And uh, I hail from uh, the Urugu clan of uh, the. I hail from the uh, Urugu clan of the 23 clans of. Uh, Europe, precisely from the uh, Arab. Okay. By the grace of God, I am uh, I'm a pioneer member of the uh, Aero Club of Nigeria. I'm currently the president. I just started my term. When? And uh, being a pioneer, then I should have a background. I should have a, a history. I should be able to have information about the background. Perhaps let me start with. Um, the underlining reasoning that led to the formation. There is a modern club, I, I, I think I should refer to it as a modern club, uh, called AOE Club of Nigeria. That was uh, in our days in the city, the old Bendel State, before Delta State was created. Uh, AOE is uh, E-Y-O-V-W-W-I. AOE Club of Nigeria. Meaning, AOE is uh, like uh, let it be good for us, you know, uh, goodness, you know, uh, for persons. AOE Club of Nigeria. So we formed it. <coughs> the partner president of that club was um, Edward Edward Oshiguri, you know, who eventually rose to become permanent secretary. Retired this retired now, you know. So as young men, we formed that club, and. Um, that was way back around 86, 87. So the club was operational, we were enjoying it and all that. And then by 91, the state, uh, Delta State was created. So many of us now moved to Delta State. The club was still there. So because of the spatial arrangement, we're now very far from ourselves. So it requires uh, quite a lot of distance driving, you know, to uh, attend meetings, different Sapple, Benin, Nasaba, and all, all that. Up. So, the risk, you know, the um, all logistic inconveniences and all that. So, an idea was mooted that um, we create zones for the, for the UE club. 
so that, that then those zones would be operational, would lose autonomy. Then at some defined time in Tabas, we'll be meeting at uh, well, national level, if you like, but at the coordinating point level. So but we couldn't carry it through. And many of us were in the new state. And then again, we're in a new state, we didn't have, uh, our accommodation was very poor. Uh, many persons still needed, their families were been in somewhere in uh, worry and all that. So uh, during weekends like that, you find that um, you, your family is there and some persons, you know, are not so not created the forum where we will now be at in Tavas entertaining ourselves. So we have parties, and all that. So eventually, we now said, okay, let's have a club that's a mirror image or semblance of the Iwi club, since we couldn't get that one to, well, if we call it a fraction of great uh, kind of uh, zonal uh, entity for another, for the Iwi club itself, because it was refused at the, you know, at that time the president was uh, uh, Sir E. P. Gagifo, who was also who also rose to become Prime Minister, is now retired. So we now put it now, okay, let's register another club operating exactly like uh, the Yogi Club. And so uh, about 1988, we now uh, formed the Yogi Club of uh, Nigeria, you know, in, uh, in Delta City in Asaba.